if it was a container ship that ran into the pylon destroying the bridge that services the DC ports, why on earth wouldn't their insurance or they themselves pay for the reconstruction of the bridge that they brought down? It's my intention that the federal government will pay for the entire cost of reconstructing that bridge. And I expect to, the Congress to support my effort. The Port of Baltimore is one of the nation's largest shipping hubs. 15,000 jobs depend on that port. And we're going to do everything we can to protect those jobs and help those workers. This is going to take some time. The people of Baltimore can count on us, though, to stick with them. This is so crazy that the people who are investigating this are the same people who lied about destroying the Nord Stream pipeline, and they're going to go and investigate and rebuild the bridge that they had nothing to do with, right? They just care so much. They're just going to give the money and just get it rebuilt. This is ridiculous. I want a real investigation. Exactly what happened on that cargo ship. I want to know why this crazy black swan event is just this entire administration, trains are flying, falling over, bridges are coming down. It's such a coincidence to me that during this administration, every department has been weaponized. Do you believe for a second that the transportation department is going to do a proper investigation of this? Do you believe for a second that it makes any sense for the federal government to fix a bridge that they had nothing to do with the destruction of? And it's so telling how this administration can't help but lie, even when it comes to just silly attempts to gain favor with people and they're tired pathetic oh well i had somebody die too once i was in baltimore before i went on a train over that bridge that doesn't have a train before francis scott's key bridge which i've been over many many times commuting from the state of delaware on a train or by car I've been in baltimore harbor many times